everyone, it's me, Teacher Jax. From Santo Tomas National High School. Before anything else, what's up? What's up? <laughs> Shout out to our beautiful EPS in mathematics here at the Division of Pampanga, Ma'am Jane P. Valencia. I'm very grateful for noticing my first video. When someone is being appreciated, surely he or she will be motivated. Just as I am. Aww. Once again, thank you so much. Today, we will be talking about the addition of integers. We will be using these images to represent integers. Happy faces for the positive integers, while angry faces for the negative integers. Let's grab my solution stand. So, how is this? The first layer represents the first addend. The second layer represents the second addend. And lastly, the bottom part represents the sum. To get the sum, all we need to do is to eliminate all the opposite numbers. What will be left is the sum. Say for example, we have positive 3 plus negative 3. Since this pair are opposite numbers, we will be eliminating them. Same as true to this and to this pair. What is left is the sum. Therefore, the sum is 0. Let's have this first example. Negative 2 plus negative 4. Now the question is, can you see any opposite numbers? Or can you see a pair of a happy and an angry face that can be eliminated? Since we do not have opposite numbers here, what is left will be the answer. Therefore, negative 2 plus Negative 4 is equal to negative 6. Let us now proceed to our second example. Positive 2 plus positive 4. Since we do not have any opposite number again, what is left is the sum. Therefore, positive 2 plus positive 4 is equal to positive 6. Based from our examples, what are the signs of the given? What happened to the sign of the answer? What operation used to the absolute value of the answer? Meaning, if we are adding like signs, just like this example, all we need to do is to copy their common signs and then add their absolute value. Moving on, let's have this example, positive 2 plus negative 4. Can you see opposite numbers? Yes, there are pairs that are opposite. Therefore, we will be eliminating them. What is left is the answer. Therefore, positive 2 plus negative 4 is equal to negative 2. Let's have our last example. We have negative 2 plus positive 4.
We will now be eliminating the opposite numbers. What is left is positive 2. Again, negative 2 plus positive 4 is equal to positive 2. Based from our second set of example, what are the signs of the given? Are they the same or not? What happened to the sign of the answer? How about the absolute value of the answer? What operation was used? On the other hand, if we are adding unlike sign just like this example, all we need to do is to copy the sign of the bigger absolute value and then subtract their absolute value. As we end, I want you to remember this. I'm pretty sure you are very familiar with the number line. The zero represent where you are standing right now. If you choose to be a negative person, you will be left out or you will be alone. But if you choose to be a positive person, meaning you are at the right path. And that's all for today. I hope you guys learned a lot. Bye guys! Thank you for watching!